time and again. We hear stories of Filipina migrant workers who suffer abuse in the hands of their employers abroad. Most of them are domestic helpers. The pandemic has worsened the ruthless cycle, at least according to a survey conducted by the International Labor Organization. The group said many Filipinas abroad are forced to continue their work despite the lockdowns. Migration is a right and it's, uh, it's something that should be uh, enjoyed no, in terms of yung freedom of movement and right to work. Sadly, no, yung mga uh, mukha, the face of a distressed OFW is actually the face of a woman migrant domestic worker. This prompted ILO and UN Women to come together and launch the Safe and Fair Philippines program. It seeks to empower women OFWs to report cases of abuse. And now there's an app available to help them do just that, the Babaeng Biahiro. Endorsed by Maine Mendoza, the mobile application gives female OFWs direct access to helplines. Meron din po itong GPS mapping para sigurado hindi po kayo mawawala papuntang embassy. It also features tips and reminders for those planning to migrate abroad. Organizers said the campaign only provides additional support to protect OFWs from abuse or maltreatment, but that the active implementation of programs for OFWs should be shouldered by the government. Support OFWs. They noted that the government must also improve services of welfare networks abroad. It is a systemic uh, problem. Yung violence against women, especially experienced by women migrants, it requires a systemic response. There should be a well-coordinated referral pathway in different stages of migration. Teresa Armatam, We Are One News.